advocate Beth Bears here with the queen of the hive tribe, Phoebe Piper. And thanks to our pals at Aberfeldy, we're out in Malibu talking about all things bee conservation. And right here, right now, we are gonna harvest some honey. Quite possibly the best part of beekeeping. I don't like to play favorites, but yeah. <laughs> so Phoebe, bees make honey to nourish themselves and the next generation of bees, right? Yes, but they make extra. Beekeepers only respectfully take the honey that bees don't need to thrive. So, superbly sustainable. We all know Aberfeldy whiskey is perfect on its own, but if the bees happen to be making some extra honey, why not use some to make a delicious cocktail? I love nature. Agreed. This is a full frame of honey. See how all the cells are capped with wax on both sides? This gentle brush moves the bees back to the hive so we can harvest the honey. Thank you for your service. Now that we have our full frame of honey, we can scrape the wax cappings off the cells. This is so satisfying. We're doing ASMR, right? This is ASMR? Definitely. Now these wax cappings can go right into the strainer, and we're ready to put the frames in the spinner to extract the remaining honey. Once the honey finishes spinning, it's strained, and- And ready to go right into my Aberfeldy herb honey smash. It's cocktail time. My favorite time. Mm -hmm. 